Wow, wasn't it the perfect day for all of us to go for a walk, beautiful weather, now that Caillou is home for the summer before starting his sophomore year in college. I couldn't agree with you more, Boris, and even more fun, we get have a family picnic in the backyard. Now, let's go in the house so we can prepare the lunch. Wow, I can't believe how much more comfortable this house is, finally, I can make myself right here at home, watching. Netflix 24-7 Hello, what are you all doing here? Can I help you with something? I think the real question is, who are you, and what are you doing in our house? You don't mind, would you? Well, my name is DW, and you're going to find out that you're actually in my house. Wait a minute right there, this actually is our house. And who in the world do you think you are, letting yourself into our house, and then making yourself at home right here, and worse, claiming that this is actually your house? You should learn a lesson about this. All of you, you better get out of my house this instant, you're trespassing on my property, especially you, Boris, who keeps grounding Caillou for really stupid reasons. You should know that Caillou needs to get everything he wants in this world. DW, I think you're going to find that it's the other way around. And me and my siblings don't get grounded anymore because we're much better behaved now than when we were much younger. Don't you play smart with me like that, you entitled baby show character, now, are you going to leave my house, or am I going to have to call Karen, Taryn, Miss Morgan, and Arthur to deal with you and teach you all a very valuable lesson? Look here, Dora Winifred, this is our house, so you're the one who needs to leave. Oh 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 Boris, Anderson, how dare you call me by my full name? You know that could land you in trouble with the FBI, that is the absolute worst thing you could ever do. For this, I am probably going to have Karen sue you in court. For crying out loud, this is just absolutely ridiculous. No, it is against the law to call people by their full names, and I don't like to be called by my full name. So, you need to accept it. Also, Caillou, it is against the law for you to have hair. You need to have all of your hair shaved off within the next 10 minutes, or you will go to jail for a very 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 long time. Why do you even have hair in the first place? Look, you entitled Karen. I grew hair when I was a sophomore in high school, and I am happy with it. So, it's none of your business. You make it my business because the world belongs to me, and I get to make all of the rules, and you all have to follow them. No exceptions. Besides, you didn't have hair when you were four years old. Stay out of it, Dora Winifred, you have one chance to get out of our house before we call the police and your parents. All right. That's it, I have no choice but to call the police. Oh, come on now, you're really wasting our time, and you're also wasting your time. We were about to have a picnic in our backyard, until we found you sitting in our living room, and now we have to deal with this nonsense. This is seriously getting out of hand, this Karen nonsense. Seriously, DW. Don't you have something else to do? So, is this the family you claim broke into your home? Absolutely, yes, I demand that you take take them into custody this instant. I told them multiple times that this was my house. Oh great, how many times do I have to say this, but this is our house? DW, 
you're the one who was trespassing onto our property, we came back from our walk and found you sitting in the living room and making yourself at home. Okay then, sir, so do you have any proof of address, I would like to see that you actually live here. Yes, I do, and as a matter of fact, I still have my bank statement from May 1st, and I am going to go and get it, it's on the kitchen table but I will bring it out here to the living room if you would like to see it. It says, Boris Anderson, are you Boris Anderson? Why are you just standing there, do something about it? Miss, I am busy right now, but I will talk to you in just a second. Indeed, I am Boris Anderson. Thanks for showing me proof. Miss, it turns out that this house doesn't belong to you, the guy in the green t-shirt is the owner of the property. I beg your pardon, but this is my house, not theirs, and they broke in and not only that, they tried taking my brother's video games to their car. I demand that you take them away this instant. Seriously, you can't be trespassing onto other people's property, and claiming it's yours. Didn't you learn that when you were younger? This is not fair, this is my house. I demand to speak to your manager, I need an attorney, immediately. Get me one right now, 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 now. The only thing you're getting is a trip to the police station, where you will be taken into custody, and spending the night. I will also be calling your parents about this. Now, come with me to the police car. This is not going to end here. I'm going to talk to my lawyer, and she is going to have you taken into court. Shut up, DW. I don't want to hear another word from you. Oh 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 Dora Winifred Reed, are you still out of your mind? We can't believe you broke into the Anderson's home and claimed it was yours. That was really really insane of you to do that. For this, you are even more grounded 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 grounded, not only for the rest of the school year and the entire summer, but also the first two months of next school year. You need to learn to stop being such an entitled Karen, now go upstairs to your room now. Oh, and one more thing before going to your room, DW, we're going to check on you to make sure that you're not hanging out with Karen, or any troublemaker, and you also owe me $300 for what you did to my laptop the other day. Now go upstairs to your room. What? Uh...